what is up everybody welcome back to my channel my name is leah lay sims if you are new here thank you so much for watching if you're coming back thanks so much for coming back so today i am actually going to renovate one of the it looks like a more like a townhouse but really it's like a loft and it's in copperdale um and so i have never actually seen this town home before um or whatever this is this loft uh, i've actually honestly never even really explored the city of copperdale but when i was going through it i could not resist so i immediately had the idea that this place could be for there's a couple of things that I had, but mostly this place. And I think that I'm actually going to end up um, playing with the Sim here um, that will be doing this. But uh, this Sim will be a student. Um, but the student, she's, I would say that she's probably about maybe like 25 years old. I'm 25 years old. Um, <clears throat> so pretty much uh, she gets the money to pay for this place from her parents um they just go on ahead and deposit it they figure well you know we may as well pay for where you live um as long as you get good grades or in return for good for good grades and all the things you know what i mean um and so with that being said she lives in this place she didn't really want to live on campus i mean she's 25 years old she kind of just wanted her own space so yeah so she doesn't live in the same city as um the university however it's really not that far away so i figured that this place could be and on top of that i mean there's a ton of things to do around here the neighborhood is completely full with things to do places to eat bistros cafes um stuff like that so i just figured that this would be the absolute perfect place um to have my sim Liv. i don't know what her name is gonna be don't know what she's gonna look like don't know what she's gonna like uh, but i'm really excited about this so if you cannot tell i got a new mic yay i'm so excited about it first of all it's pink okay let's go over that but it also has like noise reduction or noise something noise something um and i mean it sounds so good like let's really talk about it but anyways um so yeah here we are i cannot wait to play in this place i mean oh my gosh you know well i do have a, a sim and her name is alora um, and she probably could move here, but the only thing is that she's not in college. She's more of like the entrepreneur girly, but she's really young. Um, and her house is real fire. Her house was also a renovation actually, um, of just one of the base game houses and it's in an Oasis Springs and I love it. It is like so perfect for her and it's just for a one person, you know, she only has, she has two bedrooms, but one of the bedrooms she made into like her um like workout room or whatever but anyways that's besides the point so here i am creating whoever this sims house or a loft shall i say i really want like th this is that's where i get the idea of it being like a college girly right because like it's a loft you know the one bedrooms that door makes a huge difference in the price okay and so like i said before her parents pay for this place but you know it's not like they're paying just an insane amount because it's not like she actually has a bedroom the other con about this place um is that the only bathroom is upstairs um so whoever comes over would definitely have to go in her bedroom to use the bathroom which me eh, i'm not really feeling that honestly but it's all good she she probably won't have too many visitors anyways um un unless she like starts talking to somebody or meets someone on campus or something like that um but yeah i decided to put that luggage by the door though right there um because it's cute and on top of that um i just figured well if she's a college student she probably travels a lot to see her family whenever you know she's not busy with like um 
papers and books and you know just the everyday reality of a college student um and so that's also what I did when I was in college I commuted back and forth so like at first I lived on campus um you know with my little friends or whatever and then once it got time for me to not have to live on campus anymore then I went on ahead and um, I just commuted I live in Colorado Springs but I was commuting back and forth to Pueblo um, to go to school out to go to school out there until I finished school in Colorado Springs um, but yeah so she probably does that a lot um, the only thing is I don't know exactly like where her parents would live um I gotta think of that like are we gonna make this an entire family thing who knows but I don't know I just figured that they definitely don't live in the same city as her Copperdale is more of like a younger type of scene you know um nightlife kind of you know um so I, I definitely don't figure that her parents would live there but yeah I just decided to add this um first of all I love the fact that the laundry was actually in the kitchen um usually I don't do that but in this place I felt like it fit so much and there was really no other place that it could go so I just put the laundry in there I added a, a little like um table or whatever with where she could like put her laundry stuff and stuff like that um and then here I am just changing the floors and I did this like a hundred times even throughout like this is not even the end here we are now I'm playing with the walls I, I really went back and forth about the walls but I ended up loving these and at first I had it all over the house but then I think I like ended up changing it not all over the house but all over like the the downstairs but um I don't know I I just didn't really like the fact that it has the banner that white banner at the top but then I was trying to like make this more of like an accent portion of the wall because that's the wall that the tv is on but I don't know it just was just not hitting right so anyways I just kept playing with that playing with that playing with that consistently found me a rug and it is so cute um so pretty much the, the theme of this place um of this loft is pink and girly <clears throat> but not just insanely I guess over the top like we're not talking about Barbie pink everywhere um but you know like a subtle pink switch it up a little bit um you know pink pictures but then I also incorporated a lot of white um so here I am I'm trying to find like a little combination of these uh affirmations pictures but that was not working out the stairs were in the way so i ended up just um putting this calendar in there and i figured that whoever lives here she has like a little dog or something like that um just because i mean like i said her parents are not in the same city as her she's trying to meet new people but at the same time she's really just here because she's going to school and you know i mean yeah she's on her own for now i don't know where she's going to live after this but i mean obviously it's gonna take like a little bit for her to move um because you know she's gonna be in college for a little while right so um I've actually never had a sim complete college in in my life so yeah that'll be a really 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 fun thing but I realized that I had this custom content bed and first I thought that it was like a bed that it needed like a bed frame so I was like looking for the bed frame for a while but then I realized actually it's a mattress okay um so then I just made it my own like a uh, headboard and i got that idea because you know i mean if you know you watch if if you watch sisters um it's on bet and it's by tyler perry and danny has a bed like that where it's like it's obvious that it's like a mattress box spring uh frame or whatever but it doesn't have the headboard so they pretty much just put a different kind of headboard on there so that's where i got that idea from but i do end up changing it just a little bit because i wanted a, a different look um so here i also have these custom content pictures and i went through a ton of them we got chris brown brent fias 
I was trying to size it down because they're huge, but it wouldn't let me because it's custom content. So I just left it how it is. Um, and then I put Summer Walker, um, Jasmine Sullivan for hotels, Breezy, and then Brent Fias, like I said. Um, and then I just put this pink picture right here. I definitely changed the walls around. And then at first I went with di this desk, but I did not like the way that the computer looked on it. Cause I wanted them like, okay, if I'm going to have this desk, I don't want the entire computer to just take over the entire, the desk, you know? And so I just changed it to this one. This one's like a little glass when I thought it was cute for a girl. And, um, I just put that little lamp there loving the fact that there is a balcony that was a really big hit for um yeah whoever lives here for sure um right here I was trying to find because something it just looks so plain right there but I do end up finding something it's actually much cuter than what I was thinking I was going to put the tv on like a shelf there that was not working out um so then I just ended up getting a dresser and I just pretty much put the dresser like in the corner first I had it here but then I figured well I mean that's kind of inconvenient right so I just uh changed the wall color first <laughs> and uh put like a little bookshelf change that around for sure I thought that that little nook right there was the perfect place to put a bookshelf so I just put this one there um, and then she could put whatever that she wants on there I just put some books and then I put something else what did I put? oh just some little knickknacks or whatever from New York NYC when she went to visit <laughs> whoever it is it's funny that I'm like talking about the sim already as if you know yeah I was trying to do the little trick right here where um, you know you could easily do it in the kitchen but uh, on the kitchen counters and stuff but that wasn't working anyways this is what I meant when I said that I changed the uh, backsplash or the sorry the headboard for her bed I changed it just a little bit and then I made the dresser pink and then right here, I she needed a um, trash can, so she's got that. I was trying to figure out, like, what can I put over here? But then I thought, well, let me just put this, and I found the absolute perfect couch ever. It is so cute. I just can't. Um, and so then I just start working on the only bathroom that's in the house. And actually, it's really tiny and compacted. But like I said, she really shouldn't have, like, crazy amounts of visitors because who's coming over like who do you know you know so i'm just over here finding a mirror for here i did make the shower pink but i do change the wallpaper in here i'm just putting the uh some toothbrushes some makeup um a hair dryer and then i put the laundry i do end up moving that stuff though i do believe This trash can ended up being so much better. I loved how small and cutesy it was. So yeah, I wanted that little cubby thing, but I could not figure out where to put that. So I just had to leave that out this time. Oh, sad face. But really, I mean, yeah. Finding some pictures, gotta find a rug. I thought that that picture was really nice, such a vibe. And then I ended up putting this um, more towards the wall. I was gonna put a cat corner but then that would mean that I have to put a lamp and I don't know <clears throat> I felt like that there well I guess I couldn't need a lamp that'd be the fourth lamp though I don't know eh, whatever it's okay though I think it's cute so here I am I'm just changing the floors right here and um so yeah so in this room I felt like okay she could be vibing out um you know listening to her little music which i need to add like a little record player or whatever but um listening to her music studying because she has a desk in her room but her bed is all tore up because you know i mean she's a girl so it's like she's you know studying all the time doing all these things she don't have time to make her bed all the time so yeah but <laughs> I added a mirror, changed up the bathroom just a little bit. This actually took a little second. 
for me to decide what floor that we were gonna use um i don't know why i just could not figure it out i was like what is going on right now but yeah so we're back to the kitchen it's like i don't want to cut anything out of this at all because this video is much shorter i started this video and it was like three hours long okay it's 25 minutes at this point like what is happening so yeah like i said i was trying to change the accent wall but the accent wall is what made me change the actual wallpaper just in general because it just was not working so i ended up having to change that around at some point uh oh here we are right here we're changing it up um but i didn't like i said i didn't want it to just be pink overkill girly overkill you know what i'm saying so i just ended up doing a different color than that but then throwing in some pink you know um, so I'm just putting these little rugs here, these little entry rugs, um, and then I put these, I just had to replace that, uh, window with these two big windows. I really like these on the sides right there. And then, um, I'm loving this huge picture. This is a const custom content picture, um, or portrait, and I love it so much i also love where um the vacuum and the luggage is placed i think that it's just so neat um so yeah so i'm just placing this on the counter doing the little trick that i tell you about um because there was really nowhere else to put that had no idea where to put that i was trying to find something to go under the staircase um and then this is what i ended up that uh, shelf is what i actually ended up finding because it was like the perfect uh like size now i'm just finding a couple of pictures for to go when you're going up the stairs and everything um and then now i'm just on the balcony that's on the top floor now so this is just the balcony when you come outside you're just chilling good morning all the things right um so i just decided to add like a little bench seat right there i really did not know what to add up here um because I mean there's really not a lot that she's going to be doing right outside of her bedroom so i just added this trying to figure out other things to add and then i came up with two chairs and a table um so that's what i did probably should have put a little ashtray on there or something but i mean i thought that it was all right it, it's kind of mid you don't even have to lie you can just tell me it's kind of mid huh yeah so this is actually where the cute part comes in i just got this table put these chairs around it i think i changed the color here soon but i just put as many chairs as it wanted me to and i thought that the little pink umbrella with the blue was real cute um i just put this little shelf that has these plants on it right there outside and then that trash can in the corner i didn't give her a humongous grill because like i you know i mean like we're talking 25 probably not throwing down outside but you know maybe like hot dogs chicken every now and then something like that you know so i just decided to put a, like a little bench here i may move it though because i mean look there's no shade so the bench is probably gonna be so hot but i thought that that rug would be perfect for outside I started doing like a little switcheroo when it came to the windows the door and along with the walls outside uh, so I changed up the windows here put the put this big window there because I really liked it but then I didn't really think that the other windows matched it um, first I was gonna get rid of it then I got it back put the curtains on the inside but yeah, the, the other ones those just did not match it. I was trying to find a window that was as big or maybe even bigger than that one. Couldn't do it. So I just end up switching around the sliding glass doors, the windows, and then the door for the outside. And then I thought that that was really cute. And so, yeah, here I am. I'm doing the the door i thought that that door was just a little too modern and really there was only one other door that i thought looked nice i did really like this door because i thought that it matched so yes just fixing that all up I'm just 
just putting a garbage can outside and then at some, and then some lights definitely um, I think I even changed it so I ended up putting this on that little half wall that I was telling you about because I thought that this was so cute some pictures of some friends from back home her parents her siblings I don't know why I kind of imagine her as an only child but if she wasn't um, then it could be pictures of her siblings or something at the last minute I decided to put a little plant outside along with a mat um, I was gonna put that more I guess cottony looking mat but no I just thought that that would get so dirty so I did this one I think I do this one a lot and this one probably is like linoleum or something who knows here we are we're getting ready to get in the screenshots thank you so much for watching please come back like comment share subscribe i will be uploading this loft to the gallery my tag name is leah lay sims so please go check it out play with it play in it a lot of stuff is probably going to be missing because i there are there's a lot of custom content in here but just replace it with what you like your constant custom content let me know what you think comment 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 because i love the opinions and i love to know what you're thinking so let me know oh let me know if you know that notice the difference with my mic okay have a good night bye